Welcome back to What's Brewing. We are on the road this week over in the Claire. Mississippi River Distilling Company was nice enough to let us back here. We're joined by founder Ryan Burchett. Thanks for having us. Absolutely. It's good to be here. And it's good to celebrate another partnership that you guys are into. Talk to me about horseshoe cocktails. Well, this is super fun because it, the state uh, changed the law so that canned cocktails could be produced in the state and we don't have the equipment to do this the packaging all that stuff we were kind of scratching our head and then Aaron from Back Pocket comes to us and says hey we want to do a, a canned cocktail we don't have the vodka and the distilling and stuff like this so we said hey let's do this so we take our River Pilot vodka Iowa corn made right here uh, we put it into a big tank ship it over to Coralville they can jam all this vodka into these little cans and boom we've got a delicious horseshoe cocktail ready to go already so i love it and you're saying what kind of vodka is this this is our river pilot vodka it's made from 100 percent iowa corn right here in our backyard and uh we say it's better than texas just try it you know i <laughs> i would agree with that i would agree with that okay so we've got three different flavors here you guys have been partnered since april is that right on this particular project yeah but we go way back we're about the same age as businesses and so we worked with uh, back pocket on some of their barrel aged uh, anniversary stouts that was kind of the first thing and uh, then it's just led to some other projects over the years and so uh, but this came out in april with just the the regular mule and now they've added the peach this summer and now the raspberry which we get our natural fruit essences that we use for our liqueurs we add that to the vodka here and send it over to them so then the flavors are natural too and i know back pocket really prides themselves on being able to do this stuff naturally not just buying a bunch of syrups and stuff like that so um, they're really they're delicious almost too delicious sometimes and uh, easy uh, to take on the go especially you know it's tailgating season and stuff like that might as well have a mule. I was going to say that might be the next step is bumping these 12 ounces up to 16 ounces. Uh, you need a tall boy, huh? <laughs> Me? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> well, you can always supplement with one of these. Yeah, yeah. True, true, true. You can just pour them into a, a big glass. Okay, so I didn't know that. I didn't know. So it's the raspberry vodka in this that's actually giving it that flavor. Yeah, so we take the vodka just uh, as normal. We add those fruit essences and ship them on over to them uh, there where they add their natural ginger beer to it and then package it all up in these awesome black cans that are super cool and uh, ready to go. And are you guys selling them here at the distillery? We sell them especially at our bar downtown in the downtown lounge and, and whatnot and uh, help spread the word that way and uh, uh, get people in front of them. Right now it's just letting people know that they're here, that they're local, and that they need to share them. Okay, I might put you on the spot here mm -hmm. for a second. I know you guys are longtime partners yeah. at Back Pocket. Do you have anything in the works that you can give us a sneak peek about. I, the, the newest thing is the raspberry. I mean, we just got that out of the gate, so that you're getting it as fresh <laughs> as it comes right now. True, 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 true. Yeah, you guys have enough on your plate. That's right, that's right. No, this is awesome. We were saying earlier, this would be great for holidays. I mean, it's not cranberry, but darn it, it's close enough. Yeah, and I think they're unique enough. Everyone is familiar with a mule. It's kind of a hot cocktail now, but to them to throw the flavors into the mix, I think would be a, a popular selection, certainly at any holiday parties. And, and the, the raspberry seems to just really hit it perfectly uh, for the season. I would definitely agree. Ryan, thanks for having us out here today. Absolutely. Thanks for coming back. Shelby, always thinking ahead. All right. What's Brewing is an extension of our half hour craft beer show, Brewed. For all episodes, new and old, you can check out the website at broodtv.com and keep up with the Brew Crew on social media at broodtv.